Got some showers and thunderstorms well out toward the west. Anything we see today is going to be very, very isolated, similar to what we saw out there yesterday. But we are keeping track of that storm system heading into tomorrow as it moves from west to east and it taps into our heat and humidity. That's going to increase the chance for scattered showers and thunderstorms after about 2 or 3 p.m. Some of those could be on the strong to severe side, but I do think farther to the north along this warm front is where there's going to be a better chance for severe weather. But nonetheless, have our app and have the alerts turned on just in case a severe thunderstorm warning is issued. I do think after 9 or 10 p.m. That's when that threat is going to go down. But there you see the threat for severe weather is in that green. The yellow is where it's slightly higher toward northern Virginia, Richmond and the nation's capital tomorrow. Today, the heat once again, high temperatures, upper 80s and lower 90s in the mountains. We're in the low to mid 80s. Patchy fog first thing tomorrow morning with temperatures 65 to 70 degrees. And then tomorrow afternoon, 85 to 90 outside of the mountains ahead of the arrival of those showers and thunderstorms. But here's some good news, right? It's muggy out there. No doubt about that right now. That's going to be the case through Friday morning. But as that storm system moves through, takes the humidity out of the equation. You'll love to see it Friday afternoon through Sunday. So not exactly feeling tropical, but the tropics are starting to pick up in activity. Today is the first day of Atlantic hurricane season. We've got a 70% chance of Alex forming in the Caribbean and near Florida. Not going to have a direct impact on our weather. If it's a little bit farther offshore, though, that'll make some room for a front to move in and give us some showers and thunderstorms. For the New River Valley, that chance is highest tomorrow afternoon and evening with highs in the 80s, 70s for highs Friday through Monday. Check that out, though. Saturday through Monday mornings, temperatures low to mid 50s give the AC a little bit of a break each night. Temperatures rise by the middle of next week, as does the chance for showers and thunderstorms. Today in the Roanoke Valley, 92. Tomorrow, 90. 80 the high Friday. Again, things are going to start to feel a lot more refreshing heading into the weekend. But if that tropical system is a little farther offshore, we see the chance for showers and storms coming in Sunday. That's why I've put 20% for now. Keep checking back for updates as that number will change.